Hello everybody! Today's look is inspired by Hyuna's makeup and her red music video. This look is the perfect combination between looking dangerous, sexy, and sophisticated. It's perfect for a night out. To find out how to create this look, keep watching. First step, let's take care of the tired eyes. A mistake a lot of people do is they apply their concealer too high. This actually makes the eyes look smaller and puffy. Instead, you want to only apply to the dark rings. And using my fingers, I dab it inwards and outwards, letting the warmth of my finger melt the concealer nicely for a natural finish and maximum coverage. As you guys know, I've been loving this foundation lately. I simply just dab on 5 areas of my face. I just want to even up my skin tone, I don't need to mask the face. Then with my sponge, I simply blend outwards. As you can see, even with just a little product, my skin tone looks so much more even in the most natural way possible. Now I can blot the face with translucent powder. You don't need to apply a lot, only in the forehead and of course around the nose because no one likes a shiny nose, above the cheekbones and of course around the mouth and that's it. I'm using eyebrow wax because I find that it is the easiest to shape the brows and also to tint them at the same time. The shape that I'm going for is linear but as I reach towards the end, I arch it a little bit to give it more of a sexy look. To really highlight the brows and make them appear more defined, just take a concealer and highlight around the edges just to make them appear more sharp. Before eyeshadow, always apply primer for your eyeshadow to work best and look its best. And of course, don't forget your lower lash line as well. First eyeshadow, take a gunmetal grey, nothing too dark, and following the lower lash line curve, I'm going to work upwards about 1 centimeter. So from the edge of the line that I just created, I'm just going to follow my brush and let it run towards the natural curve of my eye. At this moment, you don't need to blend it too much, you just want to create an outline first. So once I'm happy with the shape, I can then just take my brush and blend it a little bit. Remember, it doesn't have to look entirely blended. Hyuna's eyes are slightly crease cut. Now with a shimmery neutral color, I can then just use my fingers to pop this only in the lid area. Moving on to a slightly darker grey, I'm using a fluffy brush and I'm just dabbing the edge of my eyes slightly to define them a little bit more. With the same color, pop it on the lower lash line. Now I'm just going to dip my brush into a little brown eye shadow and I'm just going to work the inner contours of my eyes just to make the eyes appear more deeper and to make the eyes look rounder. To create an illusion of filler lashes, I'm simply taking a pencil black liner and I'm lining the inner upper lash line. Now I can move on to a black liquid liner. Now when you're lining the upper lash line, make sure you don't wing it out too much. You want to make sure that the main focus of the eyes is the V-shaped eyeshadow. Now going back to my black pencil liner, I can line my lower waterline. This will define the eyes and make the eyes look more mysterious and sexy. Next step, simply curl your lashes and apply your favorite mascara. Now because my lashes are so limpy, I'm using false lashes. But even with these ones, they're super natural. Just gives my eyelashes that extra boost. To even up the eyes, take a white shimmery eyeshadow and just pop it in the lower corners. Hyuna's makeup is not just about the gunmetal eyes, it's also about her sexy red lips. So taking a red lip liner and just simply lining my lips and filling it in. By doing this step, you actually help your lipstick last way, way longer. Now I can work my lipstick and a sexy red gloss for a dangerous look. Final step, just apply a little bronzer for a contoured sculpted face. And now this very sexy look inspired by Hyuna's red makeup video is complete. I really don't know what it is about red lipstick but it just makes you feel so dangerous and when you put gloss in front of it, it looks even more modern. This is the perfect look for a night out. It's a combination between looking sophisticated and of course sexy. 
I really hope you guys enjoyed this makeup tutorial. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and I shall talk to you soon. Mwah.